All right, good morning, everybody. We're here at the Mitzvah Hut um, in the Raman campsite. We stayed at the, the Raman campsite last night, but uh, it's one of the huts right here. And uh, the uh, goal for today, is just a short 15 miles. We're gonna go over Mount Washington today, which that's gonna be super exciting. We're all real excited to get to, to hit the big guy. Um, slept great last night. These tent platforms, you know, are all level. <laughs> you don't, you know, on a side hill or or anything like that. So yeah, it was actually pretty pretty nice sleep. Um, I think we're gonna try to. I'm not sure the name of the campsite, but. That'll set us up for a resupply the following morning. So, yeah, tomorrow morning. I don't know, I'm sorry. <laughs> Still a little fuzzy. But yeah, tomorrow morning, we'll get a resupply and pink them. And, uh, oh, man. According to our new calculated mileage schedule, it's looking like maybe the 24th we're gonna summit, 24th or 25th. So, man, that's only like 18 days from now. It's getting towards the end. I want it to be done, I want it to be over, but at the same time, I'm, I, I love these white mountains. But uh, we're gonna take our time going through the whites and then probably kill Maine. <laughs> that's the, that's the, uh, the consensus from the group. But anyway, all right, we're gonna get going. We're, we're having some coffee out here outside, outside the uh, the hut, and uh, it's like a buck for a cup of coffee. Things are expensive here. I paid seven dollars for a couple of blueberry muffins that are like I'm talking small blueberry muffins. Anyway. Packing up, getting ready to head on out. Washington right there coming for you a couple more miles Still a little bit of snow up on top of the mountain here. Last holdouts. Mount Washington right in front of us. Almost there. It's super windy. It's just amazing up here.
At the Lake of the Clouds hut. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Whatever. No, no, we're at, what's, what's the last one called? We're, this is at Mitzvah. Yeah, oh, we're at, sorry, we're at Mitzvah. Wink, wink, <laughs> wink, wink, wink. All right, we just left the uh, Lake of the Clouds hut and they were so nice there. And uh, we had a couple of little snacks and. Pizza, maybe a hamburger. I don't know, we'll see. Anyway, head north. Right, let's check this sign out. Pretty cool. Worst weather in America. Many have died from exposure. Something scientific happening here. Oh look, this must be the lake of the clouds. <laughs> All right. Right, heading on down from the summit of Mount Washington, heading over to Mount Madison. It'll be the next climb. There's the train track right there, and when the train comes, we're gonna see something awesome. Thank <laughs> you. 
so right down there is Madison Hut. Stop there for some water. A little break. We summit Madison, which is there, I believe. And then it's about a four mile straight down to our campsite. So uh, and this rock field here it's freaking brutal. It's been about four miles or so, just walking on rocks. Man, it's killing my feet, my knees, everything. <laughs> it's reminiscent of Pennsylvania. Just brutal. Okay, uh, let me get on down there. Right, summit of Mount Madison. Windy as all get out. I gotta get down, the wind's gonna blow me off. All right, so we're coming off of Mount Madison. And uh, it's awfully buggy in these woods. And uh, man, it was so windy up there. Every time you want to take a step, if you only had one foot on a rock, you're gonna get blown off. Crazy windy, but fun. Until now, we're walking down, just rocks, so over the rocks. But we only have about a mile and about 1.8, 1.7, something like that, to the campsite. And then we can, uh, all laugh about the misery we just experienced. That's what we normally do every night. That's what we do. So yeah, it's looking like 14 miles, but hard earned 14 miles today. Uh, we're all sunburned. Well, some of us more than others. I'm not that bad. CBS is burned up. Tintin's pretty burned up. They need tough leathery Florida skin like I have. <laughs> All right. everybody and something i forgot to mention earlier was that on day 110 june the 7th i don't know why i forgot to mention that <laughs> i've been doing it for 110 days you'd think it'd be <laughs> habit all right well today was a good day it was hard hard day but ended up doing 14.8 uh, we climbed Mount Pierce, Mount Washington, and Mount Madison. And the views, it's it's outstanding. I mean, I just can't get over it. I wanted to just keep the, 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 the phone recording the whole day. It was just view after view after view. Uh, and then the whites, it's... I, it's indescribable. I mean, and I know that the, the the photos from the phone and the video don't do it very much justice, but it's it's indescribable. It's, but uh, 
Yeah, so the descent from Mount Madison to this campsite was brutal. It was just so rocky. And uh, my knees, they're the worst they've been so far on this trip. And my knees and feet are just beat up. So, uh, yeah, so tomorrow we're going to do a quick four miles into Pinkham Notch, get our, get some showers and get a resupply, and then climb the Wildcats. And once we get over those, I think we're done with the Whites. We're pretty close to it, so, yeah, the Whites were cool. <laughs> really cool. But, uh. Um, something else we did today was fun, what, was we mooned the, the cog train. So Mount Washington has a train that comes up from the parking lot and takes people to the top, tourists and things. And if you're a through hiker, traditionally, you're supposed to moon the cog train. So we all took advantage of that. It was super fun. And, uh, yeah, that's one of the things that was on my list for this trip. The bear, the moose, the rattlesnake, moon the cog train. So, so far three out of four, not bad. I'm still waiting on the moose. But yeah, so if you're a through hiker in the future, don't forget, you gotta moon the cog train. <laughs> All right, well. Going to bed. I'm, I'm wiped. I will. Uh, I'll see you guys in the morning. Good night.